you had several people in your life who you called family, whether they were actual family or not, that knew about black magic since the day they met you, whether you met them at birth or 10, 20, 30 years later. And they knew you had no idea what black magic was. But they could see the light within you. And they did readings on you. And they found out your destiny. And they found out what a great destiny you have, which is to raise the vibration on this planet and to be rewarded for it in monetary terms and in recognition. And so they carried out the plan of the enemy. They try to stop you. They try to stop you physically and spiritually. They tried to tear you down every chance they got. That's why when you gave them good news, nobody clapped for you. The enemy was using so many people as vessels everywhere you went. That's why everywhere you went, people treated you, you know, worse than a, you know, a, a criminal. They hated you for no reason. And you didn't know why. It's because a lot of people have lost their connection to God, to love. A lot of people don't believe in love anymore. And when you don't believe in love, you don't believe in God. And so they became automatic vessels for the enemy. And even they didn't know why they didn't like you. Some people knew you had the light within you, but some people didn't understand where their hatred came from. You see, the enemy can't exist where love, peace, and joy is. Because the enemy is the opposite of that. So there's no fun for the enemy. The enemy will be isolated if you achieve your mission of bringing everyone towards the high vibration. And these so-called family members, whether they were actual relatives or not, they sought to hold you back because they knew you were going to surpass them one day. And their ego couldn't handle it. So they made it a personal mission to try to stop you. To try to put barriers in your way. And obstacles. That's why they never clap for you. That's why they never really put any effort into the conversations. They just wanted you around to use you as a human resource. They wanted to use you for your beautiful mind, for your amazing ideas, for your solutions, for your counsel. But they didn't want your love. They didn't want your heart. They didn't want your soul. And they wanted you to be hidden from everyone else. That's why they did isolation magic spells on you, to keep you hidden from everyone. Because they were using you. They were siphoning your energy. They were taking and not giving back. And then, eventually, you walked away from all of these people one by one. The first person you walked away was the hardest. But it got easier and easier afterwards. And now, you're not afraid to cut someone off in a split second at any sign of disrespect. You've become so strong now that a lot of people can't stand to be in your presence because your vibration, your energy is just too strong. It screams royalty. It, it screams strength. It screams accomplishment. You're a conqueror. You conquered the enemy. The enemy and his vessels threw everything in your way, but they could never tear you apart from God. They could never extinguish the love within you. And today, they're all intimidated and they all deeply respect you, but they will never 
they will never tell you because of their egos that they highly, highly admire you and respect you. Anyways, guys, until tomorrow, take care and have a good one.